A fire at a Texas fertilizer plant that turned into a deadly explosion is still smoldering the morning after, but authorities say it is under control. Y'all need to get out of here. Search and rescue crews are going door to door looking for survivors. The massive blast shook the ground with the force of a small earthquake, destroying nearby homes and businesses. It was just a bright flash and a roar. I thought it was lightning striking the house, and I felt myself flying through the air about 10 feet. Eric Perez videotaped the aftermath. I started filming and said, hey, nothing else happens in this town ever. And then 10, 15 minutes into it, just boom. Several volunteer firefighters who responded to the initial fire are among those missing. One of the firefighters who was feared missing has been found. He's being treated at the hospital with serious injuries. A nearby nursing home had to be evacuated when the roof caved in. The wounded were taken to a high school football field that served as a triage center. Eugene Horick and his wife Marie managed to escape after the roof of their house collapsed. He somehow managed to pull the ceiling off of me and I crawled out. There's no word yet on what caused the explosion. There is nothing at this point to indicate that this is a criminal issue. Red Cross workers are assisting neighbors who lost their homes and a blood center that serves the area says donors are needed. Manuel Bajorquez, CBS News, West, Texas.